Hey guys, and how about we play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky? So, yes, I'm sitting down to play this game again, and I believe I saw two people in the comment section gave me Wonder Mail, so I'm like, why not try it now? So, receive Wonder Mail. How would you like to receive it? Through a password! And this might take some time, so I'll skip ahead to when I've actually typed them in. And there. Okay, and... Received Wonder Mail! What? Oh, no, did it say what it was at the top? I was not looking, I was looking at the bottom. What did I get? Oh. Oh, it's a job! Okay. Well, thank you! And one more from that same person. You see, this game has the weirdest codes, but there we go. And Looking at the top now, I was knocked out. Yikes! Clan Geodude, rescue Geodude. Reward Golden Seed. Hmm, I'm not sure I know what a Golden Seed is. But yes, thank you, Chakra Masters, for those two gifts that I just received. And now I believe there was one more from someone else, so I will go ahead and do that really quick. Well, you know, like, as, as quickly as I can with how these passwords are. Actually, this code is in groups of four, when the, like, this provides more space, so I'm not sure if that password will work, and maybe I'm putting it in the wrong spot. But, uh, for now I'm gonna have to pass on that one. But this one that I was going to do was from Mata Nebia, or Nebula, or... Something along those lines, so thank you for the thought, and if I was just doing it wrong, you can let me know in the comments. But we're going to continue with this one! Um, yes. Yes, just in our crew room. Okay, and now because I haven't been able to actually play since the last time, I mean like four videos have gone up, I think four. Uh, well a number of videos have gone up at least, and I this is the first time I've been able to play since then, so after reading all your comments, now I'm finally getting to play again. So I'm gonna try to go to others, options, and change the top screen to let's go team stats oh that looks nice i actually like that yeah okay so hopefully that will make things less bland i don't know if it was making the top screen black because it was specifically controls during some scenes or what but yeah now it's the stats and as you can see from the stats and i actually wasn't entirely sure where to look for this myself i didn't really look I'm, i could have found it if i wanted to but i didn't um we're level 11 and 12 so I did do some grinding off camera, obviously enough, and our bank is actually pretty darn full. Um, do I have anything on me at the moment? Blast seeds, orange berries, apples. Gotcha. And the fuchsia bow. Do I not have her holding that? I must. Okay. Well, was it? I think it was this way, and then we go to yes, this place, Mount Bristle. So go. This should be where we gotta rescue tiny little Azuril. Ah, uh, okay. So since you've seen me complete this dungeon twice now, and the real threat is just drowsy, I'm actually gonna skip through this, essentially. We're just gonna jump to the end. Um, wow, you survived that. I'm impressed. Rizgur to level 12. So, three, two, 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 two. Anyway, yes, jumping to drowsy, and I will catch you there. Also, just remembering, change the speed to fast. Good. Um, I'll also change this to self, because I'll just keep an eye on the stats up ahead. I don't need to actually see her fighting. Um, I think the rest of this should be good. What does a shaded map look like? Did that not do anything? Did that not change anything? Hold on, I want to see. So, clear map. Yeah, make it shaded. Ne oh, did I... I think I did something wrong. There we go. No, I don't like the shaded map. We're gonna turn that off, but we're gonna keep everything else on. Okay, good. Much better. Look how fast I'm moving! Ow, until you interrupted me, that was quite rude, Nidorina girl. Like, you could be anything else. Seriously, this walking speed takes some getting used to. I mean, it's not really moving that quickly, but it feels like I'm zooming around. Oh, here we go, here we go. Mount Pistle. Pistle. Bristle. Peak. Drowsy! Also, keep in mind, as I said, I haven't played this game since I first started playing the game, basically. So if I forget any or all voices... Alright. <laughs> Not you again. Let go of Azul real drowsy. You foolish pest. Do I have to embarrass you again? Gosh dang it, making me really yawn. You seem to hunger for punishment. Let me help you out. Go on, whenever you want. Alright, it's only fair that we bring it. Um, I will try moving this way, and then we're facing him, and then we're going to use an item, and that item will be a blast seed. Eat. Riz. Hi, eat. Oh, good. Much easier so far. 
That blast seed really helped, but so did grinding and leveling up several times. <laughs> We're here to rescue you. Are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? I'm okay. Great, what a relief. Your big brother's waiting. Let's go home. Okay. Aw, a little scared Azura. We'll pat him on his little head, we will. Zzzt. I am Magnazone, the primary officer in this region. Zzzt. Zzzt. Thanks to you. We have been able to arrest a wanted outlaw. Zzzt. Zzzt. We owe you great thanks for your cooperation. Zzzt. That's that's a word. Zzzt. We will send the reward to your guild. Thank you again. Zzzt. Zzzt. Now come with us. Zzzt. Oh, <laughs> he's all sad. <laughs> oh well, I don't really care. <laughs> Azuril! <gasps> Meryl! Aww. <laughs> Meryl! It was so scary! You okay, Azuril? Are you hurt? He's fine. The little guy's not hurt in any way. Really? That's a relief. Oh, Azuril. Azuril. I'm truly happy for you two. You did this all for us, Ivy and Riz. Well, yeah, of course, you know. We won't forget what you did for us. Thank you so much. Come on, Azuril. You too. Yep. Thank you very much. Thank you for rescuing me. Really. Really, thank you. You're quite welcome, little Pokemon. Only doing our job. The Exploration Team Federation has sent a message. Oh, and before I forget, I moved up a rank too. I'm like a bronze explorer team or something now? Yeah, no. Riz's team was rewarded with an enlarged treasure bag. Yay, an enlarged treasure bag. You can now carry more items than you could before. <gasps> That's like if it were bigger. Okay, wait. There's one more message. The special episode Bidoof's Wish has been unlocked. Okay, cool. To play a special episode, select it from the episode list on the top menu. If you would like to play the special episode, save your adventure progress and return to the top menu. Cool. Good to know. I've gotten the bounty from Officer Magnazone for the capture outlaw- or captured outlaw! There we go. Well done, you two! Here's your share for the job. It's yours to keep! Riz's team received a 3,000 bounty that was on the head of the captured outlaw. Wow, so if we're only keeping like 10%, that means that that outlaw, the drowsy, was worth 30,000 poke. Unless my math is completely off, because that happens very often, but I think I'm right this time. <laughs> However, because... Oh, I thought he was saying that... Never mind. Because 2,700 poke of that is the guild share. That portion was withheld. Because screw you. As a result, Riz's team received only the remaining 300 poke. Just tell me how much I get. Don't tease me like that. No way. This is all we get? After all our effort. <laughs> but of course. It's all part of the training. And we expect just as much effort tomorrow. Hee <laughs> hee. Whatever, Chadod. We'll show you one day. Yeah, it'd be nice if they'd give us a slightly bigger share of the reward. But that's all right. We managed to rescue Azuru, and it's all thanks to you, Riz. Because you had that dream, Riz. We learned about Azuril's trouble in advance. It's true. I can't explain it, but that first shout I heard from Azuril. <laughs> Help! Just like that. And that dream I had. We're gonna go off again. If you keep being difficult, it will be big trouble for you. <laughs> Help! Just like that. Both of those events, these events rather, they took place in the future. There are no sound effects that I can play. That's so sad. Why was I able to see something like that? What was that dream about? Uh-oh, my stomach growled. That's what your stomach sounds like? <laughs> your stomach growled too, Riz. I guess we must be famished. 
They were so focused on rescuing Azuro that I didn't notice at all. They, they probably should go eat. But now I'm even hungrier. Come on, let's go get dinner, Riz. Yeah, let's go eat. Because we deserve it, you know. That kind of thing. Crunch, munch, chew, chew, snuffle, slurp, crunch, munch, chew, chew, snuffle, slurp. There we go. Those three empty plates are always going to bother me, I think. Always. Oh no, it's raining and lightninging and, and likely thundering as... Yeah, there we go, thundering as well. Wow, that lightning's intense. It looks like it's really stormy tonight. It sounds like it, too. Oh, that reminds me. You know the night before we met, Riz? It was storming that night. I found you out cold on the beach the day after that stormy night. I found you out cold on the beach the day after that stormy night, Riz. There we go. So do you remember anything about being out cold on the beach? Can you remember anything at all? I wonder. Hmm. There was a storm, but... How did I end up unconscious there? Nope. Can't remember a thing. I guess it won't be that easy. But that's alright. Just try remembering a little at a time. We have to get up early again tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. Right, because regardless of the weather, we are a rescue team! I prefer rescue team over exploration team. I do. So I'm probably going to say rescue team more often. Say, Riz. Are you still awake, Riz? I've been thinking about it since it happened. That strange dream you had, Riz. Maybe it has to do with you personally, Riz. I wonder if she knows my name. Hmm. Huh? I can't quite say why. I sure don't know any other Turtwig who dreams about the future. And I've never heard of a human suddenly turning into a Pokemon, either. And that's why I think those two events are connected. That's a feeling I keep getting. The key to unlocking my memory. Was it in that dream? But even if that were true, how does it relate to anything else? I don't know what you were like as a human, Riz. But I think you must have been a good person. After all, Riz, it was your dream that helped us catch that bad Pokemon. Bad Pokemon, huh? Oh, that reminds me of what Chadot said. That the growing number of bad Pokemon has been caused by time going out of whack. You know, time is getting messed up, bit by bit, all over the world. No one seems to know why. But everyone believes that the time gears are somehow involved. I have no idea what those are. Huh? Time gears? They say time gears are hidden in secret places around the world. Oh, like in a forest? Or at a lake in an underground cavern? It's very specific, Ivy. <laughs> I've even heard that there's a hidden altar inside a volcano. I don't want to go to a volcano. I'm a turtwig. At the center of such places is what's known as the Time Gear, or so they say. Time Gears serve a very important function. Each one protects time and keeps time flowing properly in its region. Hmm, I see. Carry on. Unless you had nothing more to really say. <gasps> Is that a Grovile? But what happens if a region loses its time gear? I don't know. I don't really know the answer to that question. Hmm, don't like the looks of him. He's a shady person, Pokemon. But my guess is that if a time gear is moved from a region, the flow of time in that region will probably stop too. I don't know if Grovels move like that, but I guess everyone in this game kind of hops. That's why everyone makes sure never to disturb the time gears. Everyone has long been certain that some kind of disaster would strike, so everyone stays away from the time gears and doesn't tamper with them. Even the most hardened criminal Pokemon know to avoid messing with them. Until you meet Mr. Shady Shade. Do my eyes deceive me? Could it be? Yes, it is! It is a Grovile! <laughs> I finally found it! A Time Gear! But this is only the first of many. 
At least of three. <laughs> you didn't even have to give the lightning man, man being game. I knew it was a grovile from the silhouette the next morning. Uh, Up and at him! It's morning! <laughs> Thanks, Loudred. Uh, good morning, Riz. And awake we are, ready for a brand new day. Save and continue. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, so, now we gotta do the cheer, which I'm not going to read, because apparently I'm going to do this every morning, and I don't care that much for it. Okay. Um. Ah, oh, you two! Let me give your, you your assignment for today. Look up jobs on the job bulletin board and the outlaw notice board. Do the list of jobs. Oh, that will do for today. <laughs> Understood? No shirking your work, okay? Well, if you understand, get on with it! Alright, Chadot, if you say so. Right, that would mean I'm going up the ladder. Okay, well, cool. Let's read the bulletin board to see what there is. Job bulletin board. So, was one bird to do? Okay, neither of these were the ones that I got in the mystery gift. Maybe they were both outlaw stuff then. Okay, wait, they've been received, okay. Uh, I have too many things! Well, okay, let's see, four of them are at the drenched bluff. So how about... Why can't I take this job? Oh, suspended? That's not very nice, is it? Hmm... Wait, how do I take it off suspended status? You're suspended as well. Hmm, it's... it's something simple, it must be. Maybe if I just go to the Drench Bluff, it'll be there waiting for me. Maybe it's because I've already taken the job? Let's see, if I take the job, then I can suspend it. I'm not entirely sure. Either way, we will go to the Drench Bluff to see, and I'll make sure there's no outlaw. Uh, oh, can I not do that yet? Um. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna go to the Drench Bluff then and see what we can do. If we're just doing those two that I picked up, and can't do the suspended ones just yet, that's fine. As long as we're doing something, we're making progress. So let's go now to the drenched bluff. I don't even know what the missions are. That's how great I am. But I'll, uh, I probably should have stopped at the bank. No, I actually think I filled up the bank like full full. And I do have more room in my backpack now, so at least that's good. Um, I was saying something. I was in the middle of something really important. Probably not. Oh, just that I tend to pick up every item I can anyway, you know, at least right now. Um, except that berry. Haha, <laughs> I'll pick it up. So, if one of the missions is to pick up an item, I'll probably fulfill that by accident. So it isn't too important that I look it up. But if I can check the objectives, which I can, I will. So rescue Skitty. Oh, they're all rescue. Okay. See, we really are like a rescue team. We explore as well, but we're more of a rescue team. And since there was obviously no one on this first floor, I'm just gonna keep moving on. And there's no one here. So I'll move on as well. Come on, Ivy! Let's get out of here! Okay, you actually, you're doing a good job. Just finish that one off real quick, and then we'll leave. Good girl! Let's go! Anything here? No. We can at least take you out real quick. Anything on this floor? Yes! Okay, destination floor. Time to look for a Pokémon! I mean, a very specific Pokemon. You know, one we're going to rescue. Ah, uh, there it is! Hey, little Skitty Kitty! Skitty Kitty! There we go. Ha ha ha! You found Skitty! Yes, rescue! These badges are magical. Just teleporting them back? That's it's really awesome. No. I want to continue exploring because we have three... No, two more people to save here. And there might even be another person to save just in this um, floor. So I will be checking the rest of the place just to be absolutely sure. One second, move on! Tackle it! Ah. Ugh, I hate being wrapped or whatever like that. Constricted in some way, unable to move. It's a total pain. I'll pick that up. Stun seed, not exactly a reviver seed. I'd like one of those, but oh well. Fine, I'll attack you first. And you're dead. And now for you, Anorith. And you're dead. Dang it, I missed. And you're dead, as I was saying. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to skip a little bit ahead. Actually, 
the fifth floor was another um, destination floor. So, let's see how quickly we find this Pokemon in need of rescue. Is that Shadow supposed to be rescued down there? I can't tell. Shadows, did you need help? No, I don't think it did. Nope, okay. It totally did. I got it. So rescue the Shellos. Again, I will check this floor just to be absolutely certain. Um, but if not, we're just gonna move on. And the sixth floor. Destination floor, okay. I don't think it did pick up the suspended missions, which is kind of... Not necessarily sad, but I don't know how to not suspend them, how to de-suspend them. So, that could become an issue later on. Ah, not what I meant. There we go. Okay, so we rescued the Jew, dude. All is well with the world. Um, I'm not going to escape at this point. I'm actually going to continue on with this dungeon just to get some more experience. Um, but I will jump ahead to when I finish. Thank you for rescuing me. To show my thanks, I want you to have my golden seed. Oh, maybe this was the one that I was sent over Wonder Mail. Because I don't... But I was like, I thought they were both throw away for a minute. Let's throw away a stored item. Like a Pecha Berry or something. I'm sure, yes, we have one of those. Trash. Yes. And I will be banking the Golden Seed. Because, um... It, uh, wait, hold on. Which one do I want? Because it's probably a little too good for me right now, you know what I mean? Probably. I don't know for sure, but I'm gonna say yes. Um... Give me a minute. Okay, trash the XI seed, sure. And 15! Yes, go Team Relic! So now we get 1500 Poke! And we only keep 150 of it, right. Okay. That's fair. And then we get... A Golden Seed! Ha! <laughs> I did both of these missions without realizing it. Silly me. Okay, let's get rid of um, Sunseed, Petrified Pokemon, XAC, Causes Hallucinations. I'll just get rid of this one again. I mean, yes, I meant yes. And Trash, yes. I'm sure I have some more in the Kangaskhan storage anyway. And a special band. Uh, I want that as well. Let's, um... Let's do a Stunseed, why not? Because I, I just don't use seeds that often. I should more often, I just, I haven't yet. And a Max Elixir! You are a very generous Geodude, dude. Okay, let's get rid of an Orin Berry. So if I remember correctly, um, from the last game, those just kind of stored up in my bank for the longest time. And more food! I guess that was our mission for the day, so now that we actually cleared some jobs, we're, we're done, I guess. We should get some sleep too. Let's make tomorrow another good day, Riz. Okay, good night. Good night, Ivy. Chapter 4 The Gatekeepers. What? So, with all that, <laughs> thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, of course, feel free to like, comment, and if you're new, even subscribe. It means a lot. It really helps me out, and I would love to have you guys. So, <laughs> tune in next time for my next video. And until then, take care. Q outro, go!